The Juno spacecraft sent back new photos of Io. On October 15, the Juno spacecraft flew near Io, one of Jupiter's moons. It came within just 11,680 kilometers of the moon's lava and volcano-covered surface and took photos. The new images show the region of the North Pole of the most volcanically active object in the solar system. Io is the third largest moon of Jupiter and the fourth largest in the entire solar system. It is slightly larger than Earth's moon. It orbits Jupiter in less than 43 hours. It is the most active volcanic place in our planetary system. The surface of this moon is dotted with hundreds of still erupting volcanoes and huge lava lakes. This activity has been known to humanity since the 1970s when the first probes flew near Io. It is stimulated by Jupiter's powerful gravity, which causes the Moon to deform. Io's orbit around Jupiter is elliptical, which means the gas giant's gravitational influence varies, changing the shape of the Moon as it orbits. The amplitude of these deformations can be up to 100 meters. This causes friction inside the object. As a result, huge amounts of heat are generated, which is released through volcanic activity. A few days ago, the Juno probe, flying just 11,680 kilometers from the surface of Io, took photos of this hell-like world. Scientists say the latest images are the best and clearest images of Io they have seen. Images like these will provide Io researchers with plenty of analytical work for years to come, said Jason Perry of the University of Arizona. The new images reveal previously unknown details of the area near the Moon's North Pole. There are high mountains there that are not volcanoes, which is important to emphasize in the case of Io. They reach a height of up to 6,000 meters. Meters. Juno also captured plumes of material ejected from volcanoes in the new images. The spacecraft will make further close passes over Io's surface in the coming months. On December 30, 2023 and February 3, 2024. It is expected to approach to a distance of only 1,500 kilometers from the surface of the Moon. The Juno mission launched in August 2011. It reached Jupiter in July 2016. After almost five years of flight and traveling almost 600 million kilometers, Juno entered the planet's orbit to study the structure of the gas giant's atmosphere and measure the planet's magnetic and gravitational fields and magnetosphere. The Juno mission is not the first to explore Jupiter. Previously, probes from the Pioneer and Voyager programs flew near the gas giant. The largest planet in the solar system was also explored by the Galileo spacecraft and the New Horizons spacecraft, passing by Io on their way to Pluto.